G'day, my name's Brad Bell. We've got a 330 hectare cattle grazing property in the Kanjibay Valley, which is part of the Upper Wallambai Brook. So what we run here is a backgrounding operation with steers for feedlots. And we have permanent water in the Kanjibay Creek and uh, a large billabong associated with it. And it was the only permanent water on the farm. So during the three years of drought, we have dry dams and basically the cattle were in the creek most of the time and we ended up with uneven grazing around the property. So in um, early 2019 we applied for and received a grant from combined grant from Hunter Water and Local Land Services which essentially was about um, protecting the riparian zone but also increasing or improving our uh, productivity on the farm. So by fencing in the riparian zone and providing off creek watering we've been able to do the cell grazing operation much more effectively and it, the, um, the cattle have benefited from that during the drought the steers we were turning off were still outstanding because we were able to rest paddocks between grazing. The things that were achieved were beneficial to both us and Hunter Water and Local Land Services in that the Operations now are much more sustainable and the other thing is the water quality in the creek is obviously much improved. The other thing to keep in mind is that the creek is not fenced off so you can't use it. It's fenced in and I look at it as another paddock in that rather than being grazed all day every day it is grazed maybe once every two months for a day so you crash graze it, keep the weeds down, get some benefit from the grass but then they're away from the creek again having done no damage to the banks or the water quality. The um, result could not have been achieved without the grant funding so I'd have to say that it was a, a blessing and in the end a win-win for both Hunter Water and us.